Satsuki Kiriyui, the student council president and ruler of Hanochi Academy. Using Goku uniforms infused with life fibers, she trains her elite four and fellow students for battle. Satsuki's ultimate goal? To lead a rebellion against her mother, Ragio Kiriyuin, director of Hanoji Academy and CEO of the sinister clothing conglomerate, Revox. One day, Satsuki runs into an unexpected roadblock, Ryuko Matoi. With her trusty scissor blade and sentient sailor uniform senkets, Ryuko has come to the academy to avenge her father's death. Realizing a golden opportunity, Satsuki decides to use Ryuko to help put the final touches to her plan. This Ryuko Matoi and her Kamui Senkets will help me perfect my Goku uniforms. Let's see how strong she is. Attention! Satsuki Kiriui, your student council president, has an announcement! Today, we embark on the complete overhaul of the student council. If you participate, you will have free reign to attack your peers. There are no restrictions on the types of weapons or sneaky tactics you use. Anything goes. Use your strength and cunning to claim your social standing. Fight for change in Hanoji Academy's first natural election! Unlike traditional elections, you will not choose someone else to represent you. You will represent yourselves, your status, your strength, your way of life. Then, in seven days, at 8.30 a.m., the survivors will assemble here for a sudden death runoff! And if you emerge victorious, I will personally grant you a brand new Goku uniform! Now, students of Honoji Academy, fight! Hanoji Academy! Welcome to the sudden death runoff! For the past week you fought long and hard. However, your fight has only just begun! Every battle over the past week has been recorded. And now we know who the survivors are. Based on what happens today, I will determine who acquires three-star status. Look into retailering the three-star Goku uniforms. 
Yes, milady. Well, well, well. The Elite Four live up to their name. Did you expect any different? Lady Satsuki, we, the Elite Four, It would be an explosive finale to the Academy's first election, don't you think? <laughs> it would at that. This is a King of the Hill final battle! New rule, Matoy! You must now fight each member of the Elite Four! Say what? If you can beat them, I will tell you the details of your father's death. Okay, you're on! I'll kick all their asses, and when I'm done, I want answers! Don't underestimate the Elite Four, Matoy! I am Lady Satsuki's impenetrable shield, and I will crush you! Not gonna happen, tough guy. If I lose to you, I won't get revenge from my dad! So bring it on! Finishing move! Sunny Soul Sheets! <laughs> Is that all? How disappointing. I was hoping to get more data. We can't stop now, Senkets! Let's go! Send a soul sheets! Symphony Regalia Grave! You're a sour milk, new girl. I'm gonna blow you away! Let's shut her ass up! Send a soul sheets! Here I come! Three star Goku uniform! Blade Regalia! You survived the Elite Four. Ryuko Matoi. Ha! <laughs> Damn straight! Now it's your turn! <sighs> I'm sorry, Lady Satsuki. No way! Where'd the new girl get all that power from? Who knows, but compared to my earlier data, she's gotten even stronger. God damn it! Matoi beat me again! What am I doing wrong? Well, you gonna tell me you killed my dad or do I have to beat it out of you? Toy. Let us fight.
Life Fiber Oberon! Hamui Shouten! Is that all you have? Crap. She's even stronger than before. I won't lose to her again. No way! Let's go, Senkets! That was quite an interesting performance. No. I apologize for wasting your time. After that, I'm super interested in that cute Ryuko girl. Oh, and her darling Kamui, too. I shall deal with Ryuko Matoi and her Kamui. Meddle in my affairs again, and Grand Couturier or not, I'll show you no mercy. Thanks to the Natural's election, preparations are complete. Soon, we shall embark on the Tri-Cities School's raid trip. I hope to hear good news upon your return. Au revoir, Lady Satsuki! Satsuki divided the student body into three school raid brigades. Gamagori, Jakuzade, and Sanagayama were each given one to command. Based on the data from the Naturals election and King of the Hill battles, the students' new Goku uniforms were more powerful than ever. They provided the edge Satsuki needed to ensure her Tri-City School's raid trip was a resounding success. The Naked Fools never showed up. Pity. We raided the areas we believed to be their bases, but they had already fled. You did, however, succeed in taking control of all the schools in the country. Satsuki, as a member of the Kiryuin clan and my successor, it is time for you to... The primordial life fiber. And this glowing ball of thread drifted through space and arrived on Earth. It chose humans to become its host and doomed them to serve clothing. Soon, the life fibers will be in every piece of clothing, wrapping the planet. And then, the covers will awaken. Sealing humanity's fate once and for all. That is where the Kiryuins come in. We are the spokesperson for the cover's will. Do you understand? Yes, Mother. At last, our Honoji Academy experiment can move to the next phase. We've completed construction of Ragyo Stadium. The preparations for the festival are also ready. Magnificent. The plan is at its final stage. Announce the Cultural and Sports Grand Festival. Yes. Students and families of Honoji Academy, we have conquered every school in the country! So today we celebrate! Eat and drink your fill! Praise the Kiryuin name! Let Honoji Academy's Cultural and Sports Grand Festival begin!
What is the meaning of this, Satsuki? The time for speeches is over! Oh, so that's her game. Hear me, Director! As of this moment, Komoji Academy and I are putting an end to your reign! Are you trying to take the throne from me? No, I'm not! People do not live for the sake of clothing! I, Satsuki Kiryui, am rising up to overthrow the Life Fibers! You see, I made Honoji Academy to destroy you! Remember that, Ragyo Kiryui! It is done. Way to go, Satsuki! I didn't think anyone could beat Lady Ragyo. I'm impressed. You're next, Nui Harime. Ooh, you're so scary, Satsuki! We'll take it from here, Lady Satsuki! No! You don't stand a chance against the Grand Couturier. She's right! You're all pretty much useless for her. But for me? You're gonna come in real handy. You! What have you done? <laughs> I've never seen you freak out before, Lady Satsuki. Are these kids really that important to you? What have you done to them? Answer me! Don't you worry, they're okay. I've just seen my face and thread right into their brain. Mind stitching. That's right. And now, they'll do what I tell them to. Alrighty, my new little puppet soldiers. Get Satsuki! <sighs> I'm sorry, Lady Satsuki. Never forgive that bitch for making me attack Satsuki! She can stitch life fibers into the brains of anyone wearing a Goku uniform. How terrifying. It's nothing more than puppet string. Your cheap tricks can't beat the Elite Four. Honestly, I thought the four of you were strong enough to handle her. What a disappointment. Damn you! I've had it with your BS! Why don't you act like good...
A girl who's being worn by her Kamui is no match for Satsuki Kiryuin. Really? Losing yourself over some ridiculous emotional outburst? How pathetic. Finish what you start. For as long as a single strand of thread connects my head to my body, I can always regenerate. And it appears your Bakuzan could not sever all the connecting threads. You monster! How much longer do you plan on sleeping, Nui? Good morning, Lady Ragyo! Oh my. How odd. Oh, interesting. What is it, Lady Ragyo? La vie est drôle. Life is truly, truly amusing. Yes. This turn of events should put us ahead of schedule. Nui, dear. Transfer the Thread Palace to the basement of Honoji Academy. The Thread Palace? Does this mean... Yes. We will complete it here. Oh, this is gonna be fun! See you later, Satsuki! I'm off to work! What are you talking about? On second thought, I don't care. I will end you once and for all, Ragyo Kiryuin! I'm sorry, Satsuki. You were saying... Whatever you're scheming, I shall destroy it right along with you! Oh, Satsuki, you're making a grave mistake. Your massive ego is... Oh, what's the word? Unsightly. That said, I think I can put it to good use. Oh, it's no game, Satsuki. No, I'm afraid the time has come for your mother to discipline you. That way, you'll never defy me ever again. You said I was making a mistake before. But so are you, mother. Excuse me? Junket and I did not defeat you with our power alone. Gamagori, Sanageyama, Jakuzure and Inamuta are in Junkets. All of Honoji Academy is. They are the reason I have the strength to beat you now! What nonsense. However... I see. So this is your true power now. What's happening? Lady Satsuki, some kind of massive structure has just appeared below Honoji Academy. Wait. Dear God, the Fiber Palace! Nui Harime must have done this. But how? Actually, the life fibers can transcend space. Nui, fetch Kokats for me. Shinra Kokets. All of this is because of you, Satsuki. Because of who you are. But all is not lost. All I need to do is make sure everything connects with the primordial life fiber at the end. What are you talking about? I've quite enjoyed your little rebellion. However, I've grown tired of seeing you wear Kamui Junkets. It doesn't suit you anymore. Now, I'll show you the power of Shinra Kokets! Despite 
being unfinished, it is still quite powerful. Come to me. Colors! This is the final act, Nui. Finish Shinra Kokats here. You got it! This is so exciting! Ragyo! Satsuki, the Elite Four have arrived! Sorry to make you wait. Everyone, your Goku uniforms! Iori patched them up fast, Milady. Nothing compares to his skill with a needle and thread. I had to rush to finish them, but they should be as powerful as they were before. Excellent work, Iori. There's just one thing that bothers me. What? It can wait. I'll come talk to you after the fight's over. The covers are using Honoji Academy students as hosts. Stay sharp and fight them with all your might! Why, Satsuki, what are you doing here? Aw, Satsuki, you're too late. I just finished. Impossible. Shinra Koketz is ready for you, Lady Ragyo. Sorry for the wait. Splendid work, Nui. Time for the finishing touch. Oh, ho, Maru! I'm ready. Lady Satsuki of her Kamui or Bakuza. We're still here. Yeah! If you wish to get to Lady Satsuki, you have to get through us first! How's it going, Auntie Radio? Wait till you see how much I grow! Pathetic. <laughs> Compared to Shinra Kolkats, you are nothing more than second-hand rags from last season's collection. Mind-stitch them. I don't know if you can tell, but my mind-stitching is superior to Nui's. Now stay right there and watch as this planet transforms into a star-seed cocoon sphere. But, Lady Radio, shouldn't you, like... Kill them? Absolutely not. Humans are a precious energy source for the primordial life fiber. I'm off to the fiber palace. Okay! I'll just stay here and mess around then. Finally. Thought he'd never wake up. Matoi. What are you doing here? What do you think I'm doing? Can you move? No. 
That's not good. Guess I'll try cutting something then. How dare you! Are you trying to break the mind stitch or kill her? If you'd just analyze the data, you'd see you don't have to be so savage. Watch it, new girl! If you hurt Lady Satsuki, I swear I'll kill you! Is that how you're gonna get your revenge, my toy? You got no honor! If you dicks don't stop complaining, I'll bail. I ain't doing this because I wanna. Why don't you just go then? Nui Harime! I thought I killed you! Oh, that was just. Me? Won't know till I try! So let's do this! Ah! Ooh, this could be fun after all! Stand still for a second, I'll show you fun! <laughs> Silly, you're no match for me! Now she's getting annoying. Careful, love. Don't get too cocky. Something wrong? You got all serious. Maybe this ain't going as easy breezy as you thought it would. <sighs> Shut your mouth, you! Bitch. Ah! Oh my god, look what you did to my arms! This can't be happening! Not to me! I hate you! I hate you, I hate you, I hate you, I hate you, I hate you! Please, compose yourself. You're the Grand Couturier, and you still have a job to do. How did she keep the life fibers from regenerating? Ah, oh, well, it's neither here nor there. Uh, Lady Ragyo! Now that Shinra Kokats is complete, we don't have to deal with her anymore. God damn it! Where'd they go? Some life fibers are so tough they can regenerate immediately, regardless of whether they've been cut through or not. But if you cut those fibers from both sides simultaneously, they can't regenerate. Oh, so that's what happened with Nui's arms. Yes, and if you used the same method on Ragio's mind stitching, you should be able to free people from her control.
Let's end this nightmare once and for all! Hooray! Ridiculous. Satsuki, you're looking... well. Surprised? It's time we settle things, Ragyo! Settle? You poor, misguided little thing. You have no idea what you are saying. I will not allow you to destroy humanity. I swore to stop you and I shall! You cannot hope to understand, dear. I suppose, though, that your obliviousness is what brought this situation about in the first place. If you're trying to distract me, it won't work. My mission is clear. I will put an end to you and the primordial life fiber! A distorted world such as this can transcend space and time. One such as this can even be spun into a single yarn with the primordial life fiber. Speak your drivel if it comforts you. Prepare to die! Ragio Kiryuin! That it? It's over? What's wrong, new girl? You sound disappointed. Get off my back! Ragyo Kiryuin, the agent of the Cover's will, has fallen. And once the primordial life fiber has been destroyed, my purpose will be fulfilled. Humans will not become slaves to clothing as long as I live! I won't allow it! Divine Lady Satsuki till the end! How futile! FYI, girls don't like it when you're too persistent. This thing doesn't know when to give up. You're not going to trap us with your mind stitching again. Look out! The primordial life fiber is trying to absorb Ragyo's life fibers. Sucking up all the covers we beat, too! Inu, you're the smarty pants! What the hell's going on? It seems the primordial life fiber knows it's in danger. It's trying to save itself by absorbing all the life fibers. Careful! There's a chance you'll be sucked in along with your Goku uniform!
used all the life fibers from the Goku uniforms we had left at the Academy to make repairs and enhancements to Junkets. Well, Lady Satsuki, how does it feel? Very impressive, Yori. Listen up, everyone. I'll be borrowing your uniforms. Good luck, Lady Satsuki. Go kick that thing's ass for us, milady. Make sure you come back safe, Lady Satsuki. The primordial life fiber is hovering over Honoji Academy. It seems as though it's waiting for something. But what? It could be a trap, but it is a risk I must take. This is my chance to destroy it once and for all! You're not making this easy for me, but no matter how many times you regenerate, I will end you! Sunshine, you're such a pain in the ass. Here, Satsuki, use this. The rending scissors. You're a sharp chick. I bet you already got it figured out. What? All of this is because of you, Satsuki. Because of who you are, you cannot hope to understand, dear. I suppose, though, that your obliviousness is what brought this situation about in the first place. Jeez, but you're the only person who can sniff this world off. That's what. So I am. I had a bad dream. Sorry 
to interrupt, but I hear you're the Queen Bee here. I got a question for you. <laughs> 